The following is a summary of the facts and circumstances surrounding a recent officer-involved shooting that occurred in the city of Akron. On Monday, April 1, 2024, at approximately 7.04 p.m., the communication center received a call from a citizen who reported seeing a male in the area of Newton Street and Tonawanda Avenue with a gun. According to the caller, the male was pointing the gun at houses. April 1, 2024, 19 hours, 3 minutes, 37 seconds. Akron Police and Fire, Harrison. Hi, um, I was calling because I'm walking my dog, and there is a guy um, walking down Newton Street, and he was aiming a gun at people's houses. He pulled it out and was, like, acting like he was going to shoot their houses um, as he was walking by. And you saw the gun? Yeah, it was, a, like, a hey, black... Where on I don't know any Newton kind of, Street? Um, I'm on Tonawanda, and he was crossing... Um, I stayed back because I didn't want my dog to bark, and then when I crossed the street and I was, like, crossing on the Newton side, I saw him pull the gun out. Okay, which way? Is he on Newton Street? He was last time I saw him, yeah. I'm going still on town of Wanda. Uh, going away from the Circle K, so, like, away from going the big towards, Park. Okay, going towards Sumatra. Uh, away from it. He was going towards Sumatra, Morning View, like that direction. Oh, okay, so going the towards the reservoir. I don't know where the reservoir is. I don't know where that is, but... Okay. White or black male? Uh, black male, shorter dreads. He has a black hoodie on, and it has, like, Adidas or something written on the back. And the gun was, like, a little bit bigger than a pistol. It had, like, I don't know guns. It had a long end... But he was aiming it at people's houses and, like, turning it sideways and acting like he was shooting him. No. But I was just watching my dog, but I wasn't going to do anything, obviously, until he pulled that gun out. Was he with anybody? No, he was alone. Moments later, at approximately 7.11 p.m., a responding officer located the subject matching the caller's description, walking on Britain Road near the corner of Ottawa Avenue. The officer stopped his marked police car to investigate. As the officer began to exit his patrol car, he quickly issued a verbal command for the male to show his hands. Seconds later, the officer discharged his firearm one time, striking the male in the hand after observing the subject with what appeared to be a gun in his hand. I mean, heard was this Where are you coming from? Can I see your hands real quick? Oh, shit! Hey, 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 shit. hey it's fake! It's Shots fake. fired! Shots fired! It's fake! It's fake! It's fake! It's fake! It's fake! Shots fired! It's it's drop fake. to the ground! Drop to the ground! It's fake. Drop to the ground! It's fake! Drop to the ground! It's drop to the ground! It's fake! It's fake! I promise! Hands be on your back! What? Hands be on your back! It's fake! Alright, man, oh, I'm here to help. Oh, I spit my whole heart! Fuck! Fuck! Bro, I'm paying for my health, bro. Alright, let's get him medical treatment. Fuck, man. Uh, fuck! Listen, I wanted to be safe. I did right. come. Get the cuffs off. Ah! 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 Do I still got my pinky? Ah! Ah! Yeah, can you start with the refuse? Ah! Shit! Fuck! Please, sir, please. I'm... Just relax, man. Relax. Please, please, please. It's fake. It's fake. It's a fake gun. I promise. Get the gun's right there. Just get... I was scared, Where bro. Hey, tourniquet. Tourniquet now. Tourniquet. Okay. Uh, you hit. Where you hit? Oh, uh, my hand. You can't see it? My yeah, hand. Get a tourniquet on this. Uh, yes. Ah. Uh, uh, it's an officer involved. Ah. Uh, All right, man. You, uh, you got to go over there. Just I'll help you with medical. Ah. Uh, oh, my goodness. Please, sir. You'll be alright, man. It's just in the arm. <laughs> I just wanted to be paid. Hey. Hey. <laughs> oh, my head. Hey, someone notify. 
radio. This is officer. Bro, yep. please, bro. Bro, please, bro. Oh, shit. Gonna make it. It's gonna hurt. It's, 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 it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. I don't got nothing on me. I don't got nothing on me. No, this is just. I'm telling you, this is gonna ah. hurt because I gotta crank this thing. Ah. Oh, shit. 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 Uh, I'm just coming from home. I came, I, I I came it, from yes. my cousin's funeral and everything. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. In his arm. If any, just make sure. That's all we need. We, I mean, I don't know if they're going to need to get this off. I don't see anything in his back. You, got, you feel you're like you're hitting anywhere else, man? No. This is my kid. Please sit down. Officer, please. We got paramedics coming, man. I'm a good kid, bro. I get A's in school. I play football. I just wanted to be safe. My cousin just died. <laughs> You're going to be all right, man. You're all right, man. Get a perimeter set up. Yeah. You're good. Can we get access to that? Just, you got Ooh, the okay to roll them over and sit them up a little. Elevate that hand. Yeah, yeah. Got the, got the oh, tourniquet. I can't feel my hand. Yeah, I got the tourniquet on. Yeah, I, I'm not going to really be. Hey, it's because you got a tourniquet on, man. All right. Well, let's get That's him up. Why. Right. Go ahead. Can you, you roll it on, on your butt? <laughs> can you, can you roll, roll it on your butt? We're going to roll you this way. Oh, my hand. All right, don't worry about it. It's not that bad. Just have a seat. All right, just relax. Hey, just elevate your hand. All right, just elevate it. Uh, Ah, oh, my fucking head! Ah. You good, bro? You're not <laughs> my granny lived down the street, What's bro. Cool? Oh, my yeah. granny lived down the street, okay. bro. Okay. <laughs> bro. Immediately following the shooting, officers secured the crime scene and rendered emergency first aid, which included applying a tourniquet to the male's arm. The subject was later transported to an area hospital and underwent treatment for a non-life-threatening injury. The officer involved is a nine-year member of the Akron Police Department. Per departmental policy, he has been placed on paid administrative leave. Following the incident, the Ohio Bureau of Criminal Investigations was called and will conduct an independent investigation, which is underway. After the investigation, the case will be presented to the Ohio Attorney General's Office for review before being submitted to the Summit County Grand Jury for evaluation. The Office of Professional Standards and Accountability will conduct a separate internal investigation. The results will be provided to the police chief and the city of Akron police auditor for their review.